Point Weather 12 forecast. So a busy day on tap today with heat and the chance for some more severe thunderstorms. Let's take a look right now, though, at our live cam in Lincoln, where the northern part of the area is pretty dry. We do have some showers moving through Kent County uh, near Warwick, as well as southeastern Mass uh, near Taunton and New Bedford. We are under a heat advisory with the heat index could reach up to 100 degrees again today. We should see some relief from this starting tomorrow, but got to get through today first. Also under a flood watch until tonight. Then uh, that's associated with those severe thunderstorms that I mentioned, mainly later this afternoon and this evening. If you're live radar, here's the showers I mentioned. Some moving across New Bedford right now, mostly light and variable at this time, although we are expecting much more to come later on this afternoon. Temperatures as well, we're at 73 in Providence, 72 in Narragansett, and 72 in Smithfield. Although even though the temperatures are still in the low 70s, it's very humid and muggy outside this morning. Three key things here. So we have that severe potential today with another warm day on tap, but we are looking at a pleasant Sunday, uh, which will kick off a trend of some drier and cooler weather as we go into the start of your work week. Threat tracker, we're gonna be at medium for today with not only the heat, but that severe weather threat. And we are actually in a level two or slight risk here uh, in Southern New England. The main risks are gonna be heavy downpours, strong winds, and with that localized flood, the ground is still very saturated from all the rain we've had, uh, so any heavy downpours could lead to that localized street flooding. We also do have the potential for some large hail as well as a low tornado chance as well. Satellite and radar, mostly dry here in the northern part of the area, but again, some scattered showers moving through. The main event, what we're tracking for this afternoon, is this low pressure here that's off to our west. That is gonna start to track in our direction and start to become more impactful as we go on throughout the later hours of the day today. And let's take a look at kind of the timing of things here. So as we go on throughout the morning, staying pretty dry, chance for a scattered shower or two, uh, but then things becoming more consistent as we go on throughout the late afternoon hours. Here's 515 here, some scattered thunderstorms, and that's going to continue on uh, kind of that main window I'm looking at between 5 and about 9 p.m. before things start to clear out as we go into Sunday morning. Here's your morning forecast here as we go on, staying mostly cloudy and pretty dry, but that chance for thunderstorms and showers is going to increase pretty drastically as we go on throughout the afternoon. And again, especially between around 5 and about 9 p.m. is where I'm expecting things to become a little bit more widespread. And for your seven day here uh, looking a lot less humid as we go into Sunday here in the low 80s uh, that humidity is going to drop as well which is going to lead way to a nice trend of weather as we go on throughout the remainder of your work week so not looking too bad but got to get through today first and WPRI.com is the place to go for your full forecast anytime day or night and before we hit the break let's get a traffic update from Melissa